Every day on this channel, I receive comments from viewers asking if there's something that repels mice and rats. We've tested out peppermint oil, mothballs, dryer sheets, soap, and the world's hottest peppers. Well, so far for mouse mythbusters, not a lot of things have actually worked. But today for Mouse Trap Monday, we're gonna try out this Chinese spice to see if it deters rodents. I got the idea for this video from Nature, International Weekly Journal of Science. Back in 2004, they wrote an article explaining how farmers could spray their seed with Szechuan pepper extract to protect it from rodents. So that sounds like it actually might work. I wanna test it out. Now these are the whole corns. I also got some ground Szechuan pepper. I'm gonna mix this in with some seed and place it in the barn for an experiment. We're gonna set up the motion cameras and see if the rodents will avoid the Szechuan pepper. So on this side, I'm gonna place some sunflower seeds and millet as bait. They can come along and enjoy the meal. On this side, I'm gonna mix the seed with Szechuan pepper that's ground up. Ooh, that has a strong smell to it, but it doesn't smell like pepper. Now after this experiment, at the end of the video, I'm gonna taste the pepper, but we're gonna mix it up real good and place it on this side. That is completely covered. Okay, it's a pretty simple experiment. Let's go set up the motion cameras in the barn and see if rodents are repelled by Szechuan pepper. Well, as you can see from our test in the barn, the Szechuan pepper did not deter the rodents. In fact, when the squirrel came, it ate the pile of pepper-flavored seed first. It packed its cheeks full, and it seemed to enjoy it. I was expecting the Szechuan pepper to work, but this is dried ground pepper. In the article, they said they use concentrated extract, so maybe that's the difference. Now, I'm curious what the Szechuan pepper tastes like, so let's go to the filming studio, and I'll try it out. Well, I've never had Szechuan pepper before, so this is gonna be a new experience for me. I'm gonna try the big pepper corn. Crunchy. Now, surprisingly, it's not like black pepper or any kind of spicy pepper. I'm getting more of a flavor of like wintergreen or really intense spearmint gum. It's actually not that bad. I could see where it would be used to flavor food. It could be really good. My tongue's starting to tingle. And the strange thing is I'm only tasting it on the tip of my tongue. I think that's where you taste sweet, but I'm not sure, maybe salty. But as I chew it, it's building more. I could see where if it was concentrated, it might deter rodents. I'm gonna go ahead and spit it out real quick. Surprisingly, it's not that bad. It's not like eating the world's hottest pepper or a big mouthful of black pepper. My tongue's tingling, my lips are tingling though, so something in there might work for a rodent repellent. We've tried so many things and not many of them have worked. I don't know how concentrated the extract should be, but it'd have to be pretty concentrated. Thank you so much for watching. I've really been enjoying seeing the fan art that viewers have sent me. I love the drawings. So keep it coming. If you wanna draw a picture, email me it, and I might include it in a future video. Man, after a few minutes, the flavor's getting much more intense. Now I've posted over 600 videos on YouTube, and currently I'm posting new videos every Monday and Friday. So if you haven't subscribed, please consider clicking the button. And if you wanna see the best videos on how to try to deter and catch mice, rats, squirrels, chipmunks, molds, fools, and gophers, stay tuned.